Welcome back guys. Thanks for stopping by. We are going to jump right back into the Let's Play. Uh, we started off as the Naked Brutality and now as you can see we're quite a ways forward. Um, getting pretty close to electricity here. Upgrade working on our wall. Everybody else sleeping. So we're going to get it started for today. Pretty much the same plans as we had last time. Uh, work on the wall and try to get electricity at least get started on uh, air conditioning and then uh, the only other plan that I had differently from last time is this time I'm not anticipating any gigantic wildfires uh, so if we could avoid a wildfire that say burns down a quarter of the entire map that would be ideal so we're gonna try for that uh, but I, I can't make any promises anyway Tronka should be getting up soon Got plenty of meals. Squirt should just be able to go in and grab a meal. Oh, Squirt is going to feed the grizzly bear first. Alright, so I'm just kind of zooming out. I like to start and get a feel for what everybody's going to do on a given day. Boom rat fully healed. That's good. No unexpected explosions. Looks like Squirt's just doing some hauling jobs. What? Tronka started a fight with Squirt? Well, I would have expected that out of trunk and upgrade. You alright? Just a bruise. Tronka. Fine. Come on, guys. What are you doing? Squirt compared Tronka to a stink bug called Tronka's father an elk. Tronka subtly shamed Squirt's brain power. None of my people like each other. Well, I guess nobody likes Tronka. Tronka is abrasive, right? And staggeringly ugly, of course. But nothing to be done about it. Except for hide her in here with this bag over her head, researching electricity. Squirt needs treatment. After you eat, go ahead and self-tend that. And then clean up this room a bit. We've got trash and blood and everything else in here. Alright. Dennis working on cutting some stone blocks. So that's good. Eventually, I and mean, we want to get these other two bedrooms taken care of and, you know, get them functional so that we kind of move everybody down in this general direction, centered around our, our dining room uh, and what will eventually be our fridge, which this is going to be the area of the colony that gets the most traffic. So we'd like to get everyone centered around it. Um, it's just I'd rather get the wall up first. We have sleeping arrangements. We've got these two rooms. If we get a raid and have a prisoner or someone just joins or whatever the case may be upgrades a minor break risk that's probably just because it's getting kind of late for him so I don't know if he's hungry or not no he's always gonna go consume chocolate okay but yeah that night out in the daytime gets him he needs to be asleep he's going to sleep a little bit late and he's insulted everybody's getting insulted out here man we're gonna have to get some smoke leaf going Get these people to chill out. Squirt, what are you doing? You hauling? Did you ever self tend? Yeah. Okay. Upgrade's gonna grab a meal. Go crash. Dennis just pounding away on the box. Squirt is gonna haul to start getting our wall taken care of, so that's good help upgrade out a little bit because he's certainly not a quick mover. It's well documented. Monkey meat rotted away. It's alright. We're not relying on the monkey meat. We are closing on the in on the end of summer though. So I would like to get these potatoes hauled. How close are they? Oh yeah yeah. Yeah he's cutting them now. Dennis is cutting the potatoes now. So we'll get those in. That'll give us a nice amount of food. Probably at least 250 meals or so. Maybe more. And I don't know that we can get the corn in again. We will definitely get at least some, well, we'll get all the rice in again. Some of it maybe twice. So I'm just going to let them do their thing. Man. Something exciting will happen. If it doesn't, we'll make it. Well, the, the exciting thing is going to be that Trunk is going to finish electricity, and that's always good. So we got a caravan request. Uh, nearby settlement, Camino, Camino contacts us. 
They want 19 components, and they'll give us 23 Glitter World medicine. Really? Do we have 19 components? Because 23 Glitter World medicine would be awfully nice to have. Where is this? Okay, we're here. Alright, so... It's only a day away. Alright, they want 19 components. Let's see if... What do we have? Do we have any components? I don't think so. None there. I know that we haven't mined any. Hmm. We should have a bunch of spaceship chunks laying around. Several down here. Alright, how about we deconstruct all those? Tronka, you are gonna be the one to do it. Actually, cancel that. Squirt can do it. Not assigned to construct. Can we fix that? Yeah. Helps if I hold in the right button. A little bit of user error, though. Uh, so, Squirt's gonna go and take care of that. So, let's follow Squirt. We'll see exactly how many components we get out of each one of these and see if it's worth it to continue. Trunk, I keep plugging away at electricity and you know, Dennis dealing with crops. Eight? Oh, uh, yeah. We won't even need to do all three of these. We are going to speed it up, though. How many do they want? I want 19. Okay, so we do need to deconstruct one more. Alright, so I'm gonna pause it, make a little zone just for these components for now. need to send someone out into the wild. First, we will have to cook up some meals for them, though. It's just a day-long trip, so sh uh, I'm kind of thinking here, if I send one person, they only need six meals, and what this could be is, um, this could be Upgrade's moment. He either makes it back with the Glitter World Medicine and he's a hero and he sticks around, or if something goes poorly, you know what? All we lost was Upgrade. That's definitely what we're going to do here. So, what I'll do, speed it up through the night, let Upgrade work on the wall. He'll go to sleep here in a few hours. That ought to allow Squirt to wake up, make some more meals for everyone. And then, um, when Upgrade wakes up about 13, 14 hours from now, We'll send him off with the components and see if he can come back with some Glitter World medicine. Oh, and we just had a transport pod crash. A warrior named Joaquin. Let's check it out here. Pause it. Landed right next to our settlement. He really wants to join us. Uh, let's see, health-wise. Got a gunshot. Never understand. Like, was he in a shootout in space and he got shot? Like, is that what happened here? He does have a stab scar on the left arm. That's a lot of pain. That's a lot of pain. He is only 23, though, 
So let's see the most important part. Uh, it's not really incapable of anything. Heck of a fighter. Could learn to build and, and mine. He is a misogynist, but he's a jogger. Let's see. So we're about to send Upgrade out into the wild. We could lose him, so Chonka can melee. Dennis can melee. Squirt can't do anything. So we're really sending our only gun out, and this guy's got a burning passion for it. So I do think even with the scar, we're gonna try to save him. Um, and he can just, I mean, he's a male warrior, so he can be a warrior, and in the meantime, he can just go mine or, or construct. I mean, we are gonna need a constructor if we lose upgrade, and if we don't lose upgrade, well, we need a, a, a constructor that's not 78 years old with cataracts. So, Squirt is sleeping. Uh, it's close enough to time to wake up. We will turn upgrade's bed temporarily into a medical bed. Squirt. Go and rescue Joaquin. And I'm just going to rescue. I'm not going to capture. If he wakes up and decides to walk off, so be it. Uh, I won't lose sleep over that. We'll go ahead and turn this into Upgrade's bed for now. So that he doesn't sleep on the floor before leaving. Because uh, Joaquin crashing here is not changing our plans at all for Upgrade to go get the Glitter World Medicine. That's still on. So I knew we would have exciting things happen. Uh, I didn't know exactly what they were. Alright, Squirt's already tending to Joaquin with some herbal medicine. And once she gets him patched up here, he should be good to go outside of just this left arm stab scar. Yep, he's good. Alright, Squirt's on the cooking just like I'd expected. Tronka getting real close to electricity. What's Dennis doing? He's harvesting. Upgrades a minor break risk, but that's just the uh, that's just the night owl in him wanting to be asleep. And now they're in here making fun of each other again. I kind of hope he dies on this trip. I mean, I'm tired of all this animosity. I realize Tronka is abrasive, and she's also starting it with Squirt. But upgrade, I don't know about you, buddy. I really don't. There we go. The power of electricity. Wonderful. Alright, so let's pause it. And we're going to jump straight to air conditioning. Because the whole point of that was to get a fridge up and going. But let's see what we could do in the meantime. Probably. Uh, we, we just have to throw up like a wind turbine and maybe a wood fire generator for when the wind dies down. Um. Could get heaters, and we'll need them soon. We could get lights and get and do away with the torches. Right, so we will get started on that shortly. We just have some more pressing things right this second. We can't build the freezer yet, so I'm not going to make that a huge priority just yet. Let's. See what happens with Joaquin. And as always, we gotta see what happens with Upgrade. Upgrade should be up very soon. Once he eats breakfast, he's gonna go start on this caravan. We've got 14 meals now. So it's more than enough for Upgrade to grab six and hit the road. Squirt's just hauling in the potatoes. Harvest. That's good. Dennis is cranking out some marble blocks over here. What is he? He's working on granite blocks. Yeah, he's cranking out the granite blocks. We're going to have more than... Well, we should have more than enough to build what we'd like to build. Man, oh man, let's see. 552 marble. 150 granite. 150 slate. Squirt in the 
a sad wonder. Okay, whatever. Close to having all of this blueprinted. Let's go ahead and clear this off. Yeah, we get it. Right, yeah, sword. At least it's a sad wonder. I mean, we got a crazy person wandering around with a machine pistol here, so. Sad wonder, we can handle a sad wonder. Alright, here goes upgrade to eat. As soon as this meal's over with, we're gonna create our caravan and get moving. Uh, uh, Let's see here. Form a caravan with upgrade. He's gonna take with him six meals and I think it's 19 components. I know it's not more than that. If it's 17, so be it. He can carry a couple extra. Is that all that I want him to take? Uh, let's let's take some medicine. Definitely like 1.12 last time I checked. I think it's because it's upgrade. Or did something else change that I didn't see? Alright, so either way, that makes it eight days for one person. So. We're calling it eight days. We want to have 16 food. I don't quite have it. Uh, hang on, take nine is all that I have. Oh, yikes. Alright, well then, days of 4.3, but it'll rot two. Uh, that's right, it'll rot two days. So all he's gonna take with him five meals. And we're gonna take some raw potatoes. 5.5 days of food. Uh, 200. There we go. Alright, he's still good there. So that gives us more than 8 days of food. Gives us our components. Gives us a little bit of medicine. Upgrade. No caravan members can get the components here. Trade. You can't trade at all. You're killing me here, buddy. Alright. If we send Tronco, we completely crush our research, and she's a builder. Oh, great, you're a loser. So, do we send Dennis or not? Yeah. He can move faster too. Estimated days to arrive 1.6 now. So he does need about four days worth of food, is it? Days of food unlimited. Why does it say unlimited now? Oh, uh, let's take all this in else. Why is days of food unlimited? Oh. No, I've got them checked. Alright, that's a mystery for another day. It says unlimited, we're just going to send him. He's got the components, he's got the meals, he's got the medicine. And he can trade, right? Yes. Large part will rot soon. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. Alright, so let's see what happens. We don't get to ditch upgrade the way I thought we might. So, since that's the case, you're going to come clean up the trash. Alright, you're back to the wall. Squirt's still losing it. 
Tronka is in. And it went to sleep. Couldn't decide if she was in bed or went to sleep, so I just had a moment there. But Tronka's in bed, sleeping. Squirt ought to be passed out soon, I would think. Trunker, how about you clean up the blood and trash in here? I almost thought I looked down and, uh... Oh, we need to get that inside. I looked down and saw it was already like 4 a.m. I'm like, oh man, Trunker might just stay awake. Oh, it's squirt collapsed. Now I'm headed back to bed. Oh, I've got that set for upgrade and squirt. Uh, I don't know if that's... I'm going to make this one for upgrade right now, and not Dennis. Solar flare, not a problem. We don't have any kind of electricity going on right now anyway. So upgrade is hauling blocks to the wall. Tronco right back on the research, as always. And Squirt, hopefully, is going to cheer up and then start cooking, because we sent all of the meals on the road with Dennis. You know, all this activity, we haven't trained the grizzly bear a single time, we haven't trained the boom rat at all, but you know, we I really need to get this wall up, because we've got to get a little bit stronger of a defensive structure, or else all of this has been a complete waste, so that's still going to be, that's still my focus, is fridge and wall. Everything else I'm doing is just to push that stuff along with the exception of sending Dennis out on the caravan, but you can't pass up 23 Glitter World medicine when all you gotta do to get it is deconstruct three chunks of spaceship, so I think it's worth it. Tronka just coming down here taking a little break to grab a snack. Right back to it. Squirt doing some pollen jobs. Squirt, how about you come clean? Might need to reprioritize so that cleaning comes before hauling. I think I like that better. Temperature. We're at the end of August. Temperature everywhere, all right. Low 60s on the inside because I still got this passive cooler set up, except for in the storage room. We're doing all right. Trying to clean, help a little clean. Everything's just a mess. All right. Caravan's already there. So let's trade. Oh, hold on. Is our button fulfill trade offer? any silver. So we can trade some berries, trade some herbal medicine, that's it. We're not going to trade anything. And we just want him to come back home. cloth out here. We need to get that inside pretty soon. Let's... This is going to be a workroom, but we desperately need some more storage space right now. So, let's just do that for the time being. Squirt, as soon as you wake up, haul the cloth in. And then haul the... Can't haul the components in? Should be able to haul the components in. Let's give it some time. Maybe that'll work itself out. Sometimes it happens.
He's healing up. I kind of get the feeling he might walk on us. Like I said, I'm, I'm not going to fight him over it. It would be nice to have one more guy that could learn to construct and shoot and all that, but... A sh Alliance of Toxaraco approaching. A shaman merchant. Alright, we got Gabella coming to trade with us. Be interesting to see what Gabella has. We might have some things we could let go of. How's Trunk? Consuming chocolate. I don't think I let her... She didn't get her um, social relaxation last night. We made her clean up a little bit, so... That's fine. Understandable. Is gonna do the talking. I guess it's gotta be Tronka. Yikes. Well, we could sell the boom rat. We could also buy a boom rat or a monkey. We could sell the grizzly bear for almost 400 silver. Interesting. I thought it said, at first I didn't see it was a sell, I thought it was a buy. I was like, oh man, here comes the grizzly bear army. But no, it's just to sell it. Um, we could get some neutral mean, but we already have some. Most of the rest of this I'm not too awfully worried about. Um, would I like to buy some gold? Let's see. I'm trying to remember how much I want. Just buy it all. Should have just. I guess I could have clicked one button and, and solved that. Oh no, no, we don't have enough money. Uh, we'll buy as much as we can get. How about that? And then wherever Tronka went to. Oh, she's carrying the gold in. Good girl. Why can I not? Hold on. Just delete that zone. Haul those bad boys in. Thank you. Alright, Squirt is... What are you cleaning? She's cleaning around the wall. I love it. I would really like if I could prioritize to clean in, like, indoor areas prior to outdoor areas. Although, I mean, they do walk around outside a lot, like on the paths and stuff, so... I guess I could always just make this not the home area, but then you got problems with... Well, I guess not with a granite wall with fire, but... Still, it just causes other issues not to have it in the home area. Oh well, a lot of these areas, they're not very much, uh, not heavily traveled. So, when you first set that cleaning bell up, you go out and hit all those areas, and it seems like it's a big waste of time, and then you don't really have to deal with it again. Let's make sure Dennis is coming back. Yeah, cool. Nice, he'll be back real soon. Probably just in time to see Joaquin leave. Oh man, what a beautiful sight. Squirt cleaned up, well, most of the most of this area. And clean the trash. Oh man, here comes the lunch rush. Maybe this, this is dinner. Dinner rush. Excuse, don't mind our grizzly bear. He's just hanging out in the, in the um, dining room. That's where he usually, he likes to sleep near the dining room, so no big deal. Upgrade is asleep at 7 o'clock. Interesting. Gotta be up soon. Got an Ambrosia Sprout. Sort of to the west of our base. Touch northwest. Squirt's gotta go in and clean up after the party that just ran through here. Grab some dinner. Why don't you all those meals. Having some social time? Oh, social time. Let's go talk smack at Tronka. It's an issue. That is an issue. Poor abrasive Tronka. 
I don't know what else we can do other than stick her way up here with a bag over her head. And all she's doing is researching if we could just keep her to herself. Let's not make that a gathering spot. That way at least they won't be doing their social time up there. That'll kind of isolate her. And as I suspected, Joaquin is out of here. He will not be joining us. We will not make any effort to stop him. We bandaged him up and sent him on his way. Let's give that back to upgrade. And then we can give this back to Dennis when he gets home. Should be really soon now, right? Yeah, he'll be home in the morning. Speed it up a little bit. All we really have is upgrade wandering around back here on this wall. Although we do have the first side of it pretty much done. Um, nice. So now, so what? What part of it do we want to build now? Let's go ahead. Build this out of granite, correct? Let's haul both of these. Go ahead and blueprint the southern wall, which we should. Yep, just a straight line. And make sure, yeah, we're working on granite blocks. Tronco, you can haul some of these. Now that we have this extra, um, storage space over here and get these out of this room because that's definitely hurting the room's appearance. Squirt clean up some dirt please. Then you can go ahead and haul some stuff too. And Dennis has returned. Unloading his inventory. And there we have it. 23 Glitter World Medicine. We are definitely going to forbid that. And he's right off to chopping down the cotton plants. So I think that's going to be a good place to stop it for today. Um, <laughs> we... We definitely survived with no giant fire. That was good. We did finish electricity. We're real close on air conditioning. Uh, I'm going to guess, unless we have something go horribly wrong, that in the next episode we'll get air conditioning. We'll get our freezer set up. We got the entire, well, we got this portion of our western wall set up. We got the entire southern wall blueprinted. Um, I promise before I get going again that I will figure out exactly how I want to shape this wall in the north. And um, I, don't, I don't know that we'll be able to finish that next time. We're probably two or three episodes away from completing the wall in the fighting area. But, um, we did make some good progress today, you know. Uh, like I said, no huge fires, no grizzly bear attacks. Uh, I call that a win. So, I appreciate you guys watching. If you liked the video, I hope that you subscribe and you get notifications when I, when I upload some new videos. Uh, so, uh, appreciate it, and I'll catch you next time.